Oh my gosh, it's a shower? Yeah. What? I would never shower inside. <laughs> Shake up a martini, pull up a chair, and let's go thrifty. This is Mid-Century Wasting. week and we are back in Palm Springs and today we're gonna to be doing some home tours which I'm super excited about our tour started here at this church designed by Albert Frey who is one of the big names in mid-century modern architecture. So I was already in awe and super impressed. We had a very informative and hilarious speaker to start off the tour. She told us a little bit of background about this neighborhood and the area and what we'd be seeing. And then we had some time to look through this building before driving on to our next stop to start our self-guided tours. Soloist, we're in the soloist's room. Oh, look at this ladder up to the, the attic space. That's different. Oh, what did you do in here? This creeps me out a little bit. Lock you in your room and read. <laughs> Restroom. It's a nice room. The lights. No, it's not. Uh, school. <laughs> well, it is Sunday school. It's juice. I like these kidney bean shaped desks. These were the original vellum drawings by the architect Albert Frey. And as a former architecture student myself, I was really geeking out over these. I couldn't believe that they had the originals right here for us to look at. It was just so cool. Yeah. Somebody stood up, don't you, a little picture. Yeah. Oh, oh, let's see, let's build this building. And then Albert Frey did the plans. And then Arthur Elrod did all the interiors. And we have a reading room down in Palm Springs. And it's a gem. The walls inside are glass. It's just a gem. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Right next to the corner of the White House, that little historical area. The printing and stuff always looks uh -huh. exact same. It's almost the same person. It's, person it's on. Over. That's on purpose. Oh, this looks really... They teach you how to write really? exactly that way. Oh my god. The rest of the tour was self-guided and we all had a map with all of the different locations marked on it. So we could go whatever order we wanted to, but they did ask our side of the room to start at location six, just so that everyone wasn't all swarming together in one location to begin with. Oh, look at the car. Wow. The car is definitely part of, the car is part of the tour for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Now, this part was so fun. At every location, they gave us a sticker to put on the back of our little map booklet as like a little passport stamp showing that we went to each location. Oh, I love these cabinets. Oh, I love those. Not, I mean, I would almost, uh, not mind washing dishes with this view, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at how fun this looks. Love it. How could you not just constantly have a cocktail party 
all day, every day. <laughs> Love the pool. Oh my goodness. How fun. A little privacy breeze block little thing over there. I love the landscaping. Like, you don't need a big lawn out here, you know? Just like the perfectly like manicured rock and stuff. It's awesome. Gravel. Yeah, gravel. It's gravel, rock art. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's a shower? Yeah. What? I would never shower inside. So Nobody can like peek into your backyard and see. They have a fruit tree back there. <gasps> Look, you can shower here and I can shower there. We can wave to each other. Yeah. This is awesome. Ooh, I love the color of the walls. It's simple, but it's it's like look at stuff. look here's another living space, yeah. another living room type space yeah. out in the front. Mm -hmm. I love it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bedrooms off of the main hallway. Every bedroom has its own little bathroom. Mm -hmm. Oh. oh, that fireplace is cool. I like it when it's stone, like all the way across. Oh, look at the cats. How cool is that fireplace, too? This window is everything. I love a corner window like this. No, I don't think this one opens. It's a fixed. It's a fixed window. I love the curved driveway. Oh, I love this just entry right here. The planter with the breeze block over the gate. Look at the clock. Oh, I love, look at how, look at the windows at the top. Yeah. I mean, it makes it feel like you're outside almost, but you're not, yeah, you know? It's beautiful. Hi. Just absorbing it. Absorbing. Yeah. Absorbing. Yes. Hugh Captor, the original architect. Oh, no, wow. The counter is about Hugh Captor, and the, this is a photograph of... Oh, of the renovation. Uh -huh. They replaced all of the glass about two years ago. Oh, and, uh, I bet that was an undertaking. Yes. <laughs> yeah. The house was built in 58, and Hugh Captor, the original architect, was able to help, because he's still alive. And kind of brought it up to... It's a wonderful kitchen. Oh, it I extends. have many a good meal in here. That's awesome. And other things. <laughs> <laughs> and beverages. Yeah. Oh, I bet. I bet. It's a great morning. Yeah. Oh, let me see. This was built 
1958. Oh. They're like labeled too, almost like they're in the or they're or the architecture. Maybe that's what they're for. Yeah. Be sure to come in here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. It's turquoise. No, it's more blue, I guess. Well, that, it might be a <laughs> blue tub. You know what's so funny, Blake? Come stand here at the sink. Just stand here as if you were brushing your teeth or something. Doesn't it feel so low? It feels low, it feels deep. Narrow, yeah. Smaller. Really People small. were just so much smaller There's back artists. then. So this one has original tile too. Even like the glass. Another pool. Look at the water feature. Is there one in there? Yeah. Oh yeah. Hello. Hello, fishy. The orchard. The orchard. Ooh. At this end, we, it's mostly citrus. Uh huh. Right. As you expect, but this grapefruit here and down at the end, there's a tangelo. Oh, tangelo. Oh. Well, I have to go see the tangelo. Oh, there's the tangelo. The the lone tangelo. <laughs> Aw. A Liberace booklet and a Georges Briard tray on the coffee table. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. These are my people. Ooh, look at the door. I love this glass. Okay, uh -huh. onward to the next. There's some palms for you. What kind of plane is that, Blake? They call the Douglas. The Douglas. Something for C4. C4? Is, isn't that an explosive? BC 1297. Oh, no, I, I'm just, just making stuff up. Uh -huh. This particular location did have signs up asking us to only film outside the house and take no photography on the inside, but I certainly didn't mind because look at the outside of this place. It is absolutely spectacular. like turf lawn that's not gonna ever get ugly that's nice it's like right off the kitchen you got like a nice little intimate for your little intimate parties a little barbecue back there this one's interesting there's not like a backyard it's all front yard yeah that's kind of cool kind of cool
glossy pores. Oh, this one. My, 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 my. My, my, my. The clear story windows are everything. The metallic one with the clear bowl. That's the fancy, fancy one. Oh my god. That's fantastic. Mm hmm Oh, there's a pool. Yeah. <laughs> Love that the bed is just exactly the perfect height to fit under the window. Yeah. Like, exact. Mm -hmm. That's a heightened level of interior design. Oh, that's a nice... Oh, it's a double... It's a double shower. His and hers. It's cool. Or his and his. Or hers and hers. Or nobody's shower. Or theirs and theirs. Or everybody just hops in the pool. Oh, look at the lamps in here. Oh, Blake, those are the hanging lamps. We saw the lady selling the the table lamps of those at the Long Beach Antique Market, and she said she just sold the hanging lamps. There's no way that there's more than one of those in existence in the world left. You know she sold it to them. Guarantee it. So I just had to look up the old video from when we saw the matching table lamps to these lamps and the lady said that she had just sold the hanging ones at a flea market. So I dug up the video and let's have a little flashback of when we saw the matching table lamps. I don't want to. They're so good. <laughs> They're amazing. Oh man, they're really pretty though. I have the original lampshades too. Oh no! That's <laughs> painful. I know. You know what I want? Like? I want the lamp. Are they like, oh. Oh, she's got them right there. Oh yeah. They're really, really pretty. They're perfect. I know. I know this might seem silly to some people, but I can't explain to you how happy it made me to see these hanging lamps almost a year later after first seeing them at a flea market and hearing that there was in existence somewhere a pair of hanging lamps that matched, then to randomly, out of all the homes in all of Palm Springs, go into a house that had them hanging right there so that we could see them with our own eyes. It was just, what are the odds? It was just such a strange coincidence. Well, I was just thrilled. It was so exciting to see them in person. Oh, look at the orchids. Oh, really cool. That's peacock blue. It's the only way to 1956 for some reason. Now that's a poodle. Brick wall again. Nice and cool. Looks out over the pretty car in the driveway. <sighs> Love it.
is a fun little situation. Look at that. Gives you privacy for the windows, but oh, I like that a lot. I like the high ceilings in this one. Well, they have that same wallpaper. idea because I've seen those before those are like the vintage like little cup for like your water by your it is yeah that's a really good idea to use that for mouthwash I'm gonna remember that I like how so many people are using metal sculptures on their outside wall I haven't like seen that yeah oh this is a nice one The like wet bar. Uh -huh. It just makes me want to have a really big party. Oh, hi. Kitchen. Interesting. See, this one is rolled. The last one was strips. Really interesting. And this is like a little guest house. Really nice. It's nice when the ceilings are really high. We're from Orange yeah, County, so, yeah. but haven't been able to be in one before, so yeah. this so is this awesome. This is a new one. This was only built in 2018. So. How are you? It's tough. We're well. having you <laughs> enter it through this way. This way? Yeah, it's kind of backwards. But okay. It flows better. Hi. Uh, so you. Oh. Cool. Oh. <laughs> Understatement.
Blake. There I am. <laughs> oh, cool bar. That's fun. <laughs> laundry a little powder room i love this terrazzo the floor and the the counters cool. i love the terrazzo that's nice I like that. even if it's faux terrazzo i love it It's a shower. How come all I want in life now is an outdoor shower? <laughs> I didn't know that this was something that I desired until I started seeing these. Now I want one. All right, that one wins so far. We have one more to look at, but that one was my favorite. <laughs> well, yeah, they're they're spiky. Oh, look at that door. You don't mess with our desert lands. No, no, it, it fights back. <laughs> Being the last stop of the day, and they did suggest to us to end on this house, it was quite crowded because this was the end of the tour and everyone was kind of convening at this final stop, but I did my best to film a little bit for you guys anyway. Nice office. Hide. Look at how it's lit oh, underneath. Fantastic. Hello, Big Mike. Love it. Look, it's one of those, like in Isle of Lucy, where the closet is behind oh, yeah. the bed, and there's two doors to go in. Oh, I love that. That's amazing. Oh. Wow, so the bathtub is even within the shower doors. Mm -hmm. Neat. Do you think they would let me take a bath real quick? Oh, bummer. <laughs> really? That's frowned upon? This door is extra. I can certainly see why they wanted us to end on this home as it was absolutely spectacular. That wall that opened up completely to the backyard was just everything. 
Well, that concludes our eight home home tour. In this neighborhood, we have one more tour to go to later today, but first we're gonna go get some lunch. Uh, that was super fun. Did you like it, Blake? Great. It was really great. Rock. My favorite was house number seven, the Eichler. Yes. I'm a sucker for an atrium, what can I say? So we're gonna get some lunch and then go on our second tour, but I'll put that in the next video. So for now, ta-ta for now, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye everyone, say bye Blake. Bye.